Welcome, y'all, to the new season of Anastalgia. It's me, your space captain, Kamal, here. And Ooh. I got with me my great guest host to my left, starting with... The GOAT, Micah, a.k.a. Dark Souls Thug. <laughs> What's going on? All right. <laughs> It's your girl, Jada. <laughs> and Lauren. What's up, guys? Yes, we got Lauren. We got the few people here. You know, I always keep Jada and Michael with me on deck. <laughs> and, you know, some people, you know, from the good old Game & Wolf, you know, stay in the back of the ship. They just come by every now and then. The good old Game & Wolf. That's right. Random That's right. opinions. We don't be in the back. We got our okay. own ship. We just be, we be racing. We be chilling. Exactly. So it's like a ship meet. wasting fluid? What is wrong with y'all? We're mercenaries. We got fluid money. Mercenaries. Bro, not with this money. I got this on Bush.com. <laughs> Anyways, Anastalgia, for those who don't know, is a show based on animes and our favorite childhood cartoons. That's right. And we want to start off with a nice, good question. What is considered an anime? Mm -hmm. Who wants to go first? Because I can make a whole <laughs> mental essay about this well, right now. Before you even go to there. That's a lot to unpack. Animes, you know, just really, they're busy just animations produced in Japan. That's yeah. what, like, Wikipedia, you know, everyone says. By definition. <laughs> I'm about exactly. to say, By what is definition. the definition? But that's what we, we need to discuss. It. You know? What exactly. it, like for me personally, you know, even I consider shows that are like anime inspired, you know, mm -hmm. those could be, you know, considered anime. <laughs> yeah, they're like influenced. I got by one. Yeah. We'll talk about it in a minute, but I got a, a manga inspired comic that I would kind of consider a manga, although it reads the American way, you know, from left to right instead of right to left. Oh, OK. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What's it called? Mm -hmm. It's called Mega Tokyo. Get out. How? <laughs> you know how. Take the headphones off and walk out the door. <laughs> if he walks out the door, he's going to be sucked in the space. Right. That sounds more like a personal problem on his point. So no, it sounds like y'all want me to die. I'm the best thief on the team. How y'all going to crack safes and stuff without me? How y'all going to go on sweet jobs? Why do you... What? It's, we're on a spaceship, sir. Exactly. Jada, you acting like, like we ain't got plenty of copies of you in the back of the ship. Stop it. There's no copy like me. There's nobody like me. We that even you started. know of. Whoa, whoa, whoa. So whoa. <laughs> Jada out here trying to get the show canceled before he even started. Oh, God. <laughs> no, I'm not. Yo, I Wait. remember one time I, I I follow a um King of the Hill fan page on Facebook. Oh, that's got to be random. <laughs> they have, I'm sorry. They have no, a fan page. Random. Because, Come no, on. It's, it's going to make sense because someone called it Texas anime. <laughs> <laughs> I'll oh, that's crazy. Yeah, that's actually really funny. That's really funny. We need a sound effect for that because Texas that right anime, there was mouth dropping. That that's was funny. Hey, yo, in insert that uh, Ang Hill going, whoa. <laughs> <laughs> nah, 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 nah. <laughs> you. <laughs> dang it, Bobby. <laughs> dang it, Bobby. No, that's really Put some down the dang I like this new generation of music. I gotta tweet music. that one out. That's hilarious. <laughs> oh, my God. You know, that's Texas anime. I just, want, <laughs> I just want a picture of a god dang hot dog. <laughs> I just want my new season. I never <laughs> understood what that show was about. I just Me saw. Me neither. I just saw like the intro of it, and then they when I saw drink beer outside, right? It's, That's a, all they it's do. a Texan selling propane and propane accessories. Yeah, propane it seems accessories. Like whatever the Texan is like, like that seems like what they do every day. <laughs> oh drink beer God. outside in their backyard. So I'm not understanding. This takes place. King of the Hill takes place in Texas. It does. Yeah, in okay. Harlan, Texas. Okay. Oh, yeah. It actually does. Yeah. Oh, that makes God. it even funnier. The show got so popular. They've actually done collab, plenty of collab episodes with like family guys that's what i was just about to say right. and it'd be so funny because in one episode the dad was like dang it i always wake up before i know what the baby's about to say right. i was I like remember stop that. Yeah. <laughs> family guy will cross over with anybody like seriously Why it, never that's funny family guy needs to cross over like supreme or something <laughs> like, family really guy go for supreme. that bag they've done everybody except american dad i don't know why they won't do american dad they but did like, a, they did have a crossover episode with them in the cleveland yep, show they did it was a hurricane episode like all three of them had a hurricane that wasn't a crossover man like, they were the on there for like end. three minutes no, the, the I want an episode, episode, like the Simpsons and the Family Guy where they were fighting it out. Oh, yeah. I want an Wait, episode like that. that was Not this yeah. little one to two minutes because they did that mess with Bob's Burgers. They're talking all about, right. oh, y'all took up all the time with the show. They really trashed Bob's that? Burgers for what no was that? reason. But they have a whole movie. Family Guy don't even have a movie. So oh, how are y'all How are right. y'all burning them? The Family Guy has the rights to Star Wars. Well, not the rights per se, but they're the only people who got to make Listen. a Star Wars parody like that. Listen, Yo, had the rights to Star we Wars. all know that the reason the why season. they have the rights. Come on now. Because they're cool with Lucas. What is it, Lucas Films? Because Lucas Films loves Family Guy. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> oh he God. literally went and asked their permission. He was like, uh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes, do it. <laughs> all right. So, but for real, for the anime. <laughs> Okay, yeah, we topic. were way off topic. You gotta edit this, like, crazy. Nah, uh, it was still it's still animation, but that was just mm -hmm. more on the lines of like American animation. Yeah. Texan, yeah. animation. T Texan animation is king of the hill. 
<laughs> tech what, summations. So what would y'all consider the difference between Japanese anime and American anime? Like, how would you know the true difference? Aside from, like, the languages. Definitely, course. like, the animation they decide to use for their yeah. characters. And even, like, I've seen some shows, like, use certain anime fighting styles. Mm. So it's like they inspire just, like, not only just the way it looks, but literally the way they're animated. Mm-hmm. Right, right, yeah. Okay. It's really boondocks. We'll get into that later, though. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Um, I don't know. For me, I guess... Excuse me. Sorry. I guess um, I agree with Lauren on the animation, because just growing up and seeing the timeline of how the animation has changed, is that is a big factor into it. I guess also the plot and the lesson behind it, because you see, like, you, you realize you can, like... Um, I guess... I can't think of the word for it. It's like you can really... <sighs> can't think of the word oh god i have a brain decipher no no relate to him thank you you (laughs) You can really relate to him so i guess that's the difference between like the kids shows now from like disney to nick to cartoon network you can't really yeah you can't really relate to him like you can with the animes and that's what i had to explain to my parents about it because i really like naruto and like naruto had me crying a couple of times like mm-hmm. like they didn't have to do Nachi like that they but did not. yeah <laughs> they didn't they could have if they were going to take him out they could have took him out better <laughs> like seriously make the man go out like a g I'm what about be- you micah uh, so I'm with y'all. It's definitely a lot about animation for me. I pay attention to a lot of how American and then Japanese animations are made. It seems like um, in Japanese ones, they seem to get multiple people to do the animations. Like they'll do certain fr- a certain amount of frames and then pass it on to somebody. That's what I see a lot of. Where most of the time in America, it's either like maybe one animator or maybe one team. Mm-hmm. I feel like um, Japanese animations can be a lot more inclusive because that's why people post their art on Twitter. They're always looking for people and that's how people get out there and um it goes a little bit towards voice acting too like obviously we have our english dubs but you can tell when an anime is being voice acted because the way they talk nobody would necessarily talk like that in real life (laughs) and if you do then you watch way too much anime uh, most American Facts. ones, um, I mean, people aren't really talking like that, like that in real life either, but it's a little more relatable because, you know, it's the original language. So some people probably would say that like that, maybe not as loud, maybe not in that exact voice, but it's a little more relatable than saying, oh, uh, I got to go to class to meet senpai. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm going to class. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Yo, like, nah. you ever had that like classmate or like you knew that's one kid who the did that? Naruto runs yeah. through the hall. I was partially yeah. that kid. Or even yeah. like, I was her dialogue, yeah. like like you tried to do a joke and they finished the joke like, how did he know my joke? Oh my God. <laughs> it's like, bro, you're talking out loud. We can all hear you, first off. Yo, that's what we not finna do today. As a band kid, yes. I think what it was the tuba players that would be running like oh, Naruto. I'm God, like, oh, y'all, gosh. yes. Can y'all take the practice seriously? We are here but way too long because y'all keep playing around. <laughs> like, I get the I get the joke, but come on now. No, we gotta no, go. No disrespect. I do know a fellow uh <laughs> band kid who who would run to his spot, um, Naruto run. Um we love you, Shem. Oh. But um <laughs> 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 to be fair, yo, I, I do the same thing too. I, I, you know, I be Naruto speed walking, you know. When I was a kid, I was not. I didn't Naruto that. run. See, oh my god, we gosh. love you, Shams. We love you, buddy. <laughs> but um, I wasn't doing the Naruto. Well, I was doing the Naruto run, but I was getting it from Sonic because he does the run. That's where I got it from. I didn't does see he? Naruto. Yeah, in most of the his arms in his modern guy. games, yeah, his arms back. are behind his. Oh, yeah. mm-hmm. That makes sense. Wow. He might start up running normally, but then when he gets oh, fast. Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. I really need to like we need to do a test like a to see who runs speed faster. Test? If it runs like, faster. Like, <laughs> like like using your arms or having it behind you. Like we're really going to see. I feel see like it has to be like behind you. Like remember when they was raiding like uh, mm. Area 51? They all had their eye, <laughs> arms behind them. Oh yeah, they sure did. The I remember that. What were they dressed like though? That's, what were they dressed like though? <laughs> <laughs> like what outfit like did they have on like like a freaking like they have them, like, they all the like Naruto. They didn't, like, take showers, though, I'm not going to lie, because they were oh, out dang. there for a while. Damn. Anyway. <laughs> they really tried to raid Area 51 like they that was going Yeah. Uh, no. It would have been awesome if it really happened, though. Could have came out there with the Omnitrix. People bored back then. Could have came out there with a Keyblade. <laughs> Yo, it's stupid. Right. Yo, okay, so. Not the Keyblade. <laughs> you know, it's, I looked up, you know, American animes, you know, so okay. we can have, like, you know, some examples. And I remember me and Lauren looked at this in the spring, Number 15 is Steven Universe. And oh, that's yeah. why, to this day, I, I call Steven, Steven Universe, Universe an anime. The anime it's community loves them. It's not necessarily. It's not, but you it's can not definitely. An anime. 
You it's definitely, definitely some tell. anime influence. It's, yeah. It has anime. Yes, yes, anime yes. Influence. I definitely agree. It has a very strong anime influence, and you definitely will see the characters at Anime Con and Anime Weekend that's coming up in two weeks. Yep. Let's go. And Garnet was busted in multiverses. Like, right? seriously. <laughs> so at this point, I feel like Steven so Universe Steven. is more like on the line. It's on the borderline of it can be right. anime and it can't be, but honestly, it depends on the person and who's watching it, yeah. honestly. The that's, gaming community took um, Steven Universe and ran too. See? Yeah. Yeah. They it's, love it. It's got a small amount of filler on there, but it's got the filler where it's like, this actually still makes sense. Exactly. Mm-hmm. It's just enough. That's why I, I love watching it. I love recommending it to people because Rebecca Sugar, like, she really did her thing with it. Oh, her. yeah. She, she did. really put her foot I love it. Like, and the filler is better than other animes. <clears throat> Naruto. Ooh, um, and moving on. <laughs> anyways, dang. you got like things like uh, Ben 10 on here. Oh, okay, boy. Don't okay. get me started on Ben 10, boy. Ooh. Uh, Dota, Dra- Dragon's Blood. Batman the Animated familiar. Series. That's oh, very yeah. interesting. Yeah. Take that off the list. <laughs> uh, Ultimate Spider-Man. Yeah. Okay, okay. Uh, the Boondocks was number 10. Yeah. All right. She-Ra and the Princesses of Power. She-Ra. It looks, it looks very animated-ish. Not gonna lie. Voltron, to Legendary right Defender. Mm-hmm. Okay. Oh, now that's coming back to me. I totally remember where that's from. The dude, yeah, like Blue Lightning, and it was yeah. some robot that fall. Oh, right, that's co- yeah. all coming back to me now. Yeah. yeah R-W-B-Y, which... That I'm guessing that's just the, I guess it's just the colors that they are, red, white, blue, and yellow. No, that, that sounds sense. familiar. Uh, uh, Teen Titans. Oh, wait a minute. You oh, said R-W-B-Y? Yeah. That's Ruby. Oh, it's just, oh, wow. Mm. I didn't know that. Yeah, uh, that's in a, um, I can go into Iceberg about that too. We'll save it. Uh, Invincible, if y'all seen this on the mm. Oh my um, gosh, man. Mm-hmm. That thing is crazy. She's more like a pet to me. <laughs> I can't. Yep. You said what is more like a pet? This man called his wife a pet. Hey. Yep. Yep. He Black basically Air- called the whole entire human race his pet. Trash. Black Air Force Energy is his finest. Uh, <laughs> Samurai Jack. Yep. Uh, I was, was going to oh mention that. Oh, my gosh. Is that even still on? It's not on, but I don't know if they finished it or not. They were definitely That's doing what I some heard. seasons. They were, like, ago. trying to remake it up mm-hmm. to, like, finish it out. And it wasn't on Cartoon Network. It was on Adult Swim. It was Yeah, they, yeah, they had to take it off Cartoon mm-hmm. Network after a time. Shout out <laughs> to my man Phil Lamar, who voiced um, Samurai Jack. Man, yeah. my dad loved that yeah. show. Uh, Castlevania is number three. That... Isn't that on Netflix? That's an anime, isn't it? Is that's that on that? Netflix. That's an anime. Yeah, he must be. I'm guessing, but yeah. I guess it's made in America. So he must be talking about the Castlevania game that also got a few animated series. Oh. Yeah, I'm just, I'm just reading that? the list. I'm not like coming off top of Don't. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. yeah uh, can y'all guess what the top two are? <laughs> Avatar. Pokemon. The Avatar does Airbender. need to be in there. Yeah. It, it does. It needs to be in there. Mm-hmm. That is number two. Korra. No, it can't be Korra because that's basically Avatar. We know it. <laughs> oh my god, I want to guess it. Um, I guess it's, it's not Pokemon. Though? It's based honestly off a of video game. Just tell us what is it? Uh, Ar- Digimon. Arcane. 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 He made that into a show. Yeah, you know, it was on Netflix. Look at that. The people from the know. game. No, I just heard of it this. as the game. Yeah. Didn't know no, about no. It. That's why I was telling you. Uh, there's a difference between Arcane Jinx and the game Jinx because ah. Arcane Jinx is actually crazy. Uh, the game Jinx is. Like a co- comic, I wasn't, I wasn't a putting one and two. It, I yeah. was not putting one and two together when you <laughs> said it. <laughs> but speaking of Jinx, one of the animes we were talking about, or considered anime, Teen Titans. Mm. <laughs> what about it? I definitely agree. Hey, what about it? Hey. Wait, wait, which one? Which version? Which one you want? <laughs> hey, we take. I'll take OG and Go. Yeah, Go is I'm good. I'm just taking OG. I'm not taking Go. Hey, I'll state your go. claims. State your claims in the court of law. Uh, only in because the they law. make Tessa out to be the bad guy. They make her out to be the villain in Go. Like a Even though villain. in the original series, she definitely was torn between good or evil because she didn't know who she was herself. And as any teenage girl, as, as Wait, anybody... Wait, you talking about Tara? Tara? Oh, yeah. what did I say? I'm sorry. Tessa. Ooh, I'm sorry. You sure did say Tesla, but I knew Ooh. exactly what you were talking about. Oh, sorry. Like Tara. Also, um, I was just trying to figure out why she... you consider it anime she definitely hold teen times like she right that's so i'm like like they at the at the very end where she had to go and save beast boy from slate like and wait you're ma- defending her yes i am no what do you think she was defending right oh yeah no no no, no. tara is yeah. nah she's problematic <laughs> and she needed to go she's you're problematic because go. she's a teenage girl who doesn't know how to take care she of herself like she didn't know who beast boy was in the last episode of course i think she that was did. some kind of brain thing you exactly. that or she was doing on yeah, she was being like, brain controlled she, by slaves. Yeah. He did that or she had all her memories erased. Man, point blank, period. She was a teenager who just didn't Ever, know. Bro. And everybody knows, as, as all of us have grown up, we all had that point where we were lost. Yeah. 
and right. we all needed that guidance. I'm we still needed lost. that friend. Somebody help Mike. This isn't about you. Right. We're just gonna discuss why we all think Teen Titans is an anime. All right, all right, all right. First off, let's talk about the the style. The drawing mm-hmm. of it already like gives off that oh, anime vibe. Man. Yeah. Yeah. Especially Starfire's eyes. <sighs> Man, bump say fire. that Sis, Raven. Say that for another time, sir. Like shut up, shut up, shut up. And then Cyborg. We got a jar for that. I brought. Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up. When I bought the ship, I I bought a new jar. It's the it's WSP in the ship. jar. Oh yeah, it's right there. The simp jar oh. is here, sir. Put a quarter <laughs> in there. My guy has two. He has two simp jars. Wow. <laughs> Where's the other one? You caught in 4K, buddy. Twice Yikes. the punishment. I don't know what you're talking about. You caught in 440 words. I don't know what you're talking about. I should show them the video. <laughs> but the, act- the action <laughs> on the show, too, the dialogues, the storytelling. Yeah. Oh, yeah, sh- definitely. And obviously, like, the theme song. Oh, yeah, oh, I was just going to get into that. So it was originally made, well, I don't know if they made both versions uh, at the same time, but there's an English version and there's yep. a Japanese version. Yep, the Japanese version hey. plays when the episode is more serious. I never realized that's yeah. what they were Look doing. Look at my man, the human encyclopedia over here. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. <laughs> And then, um, not to mention, Teen Titans literally did go to Tokyo. They had a whole movie about it. It was so cool. Boy, that's when, that was in the that blockbuster way. days. I almost got my mom in trouble because I didn't want to return it. <laughs> Man, every time I saw that thing came on that Cartoon Network, I was like, Ruben, come oh, on. Yes. We got to go. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. It's been sampled you know multiple times. <laughs> No Dang, copyright. Copy. We're not gonna sing. No copyright. Copy. Copy. <laughs> I like how Beast Boy and didn't he end up singing the song in the show he in the did. movie? I think so. Yeah. Yeah, he went to the karaoke bar mm-hmm. and it was so cute. I was like, oh yeah, That's that was adorable. Mm-hmm. Speaking of Beast Boy, I'm just say the one best thing about Teen Titans Go, they, their their music selection was pretty. Mm-hmm. Like Teen, like Beast Boy had a song called Catching Villains. That I won't be catching villains. villains. Buns, paddle, pickle, cheese. Put that patty in between his burger. What? What is burger? What? Oof. What? Buns, lettuce, pickle, cheese. Put that patty on. <laughs> they had a waffle, waffle, waffle. Oh yeah, they showed it. But waffle, waffle, waffle. waffle. And, and then, yeah. and then, yeah, I remember that one. They had Lil Yachty come on and make a song for it. I didn't think it was good, yeah. but it was just good to see Lil Yachty on TV. He's out to the wall, to the tower. The tower. <laughs> oh goodness! Just burn it down. Best box. Just burn it down. Hey, uh, I think also, Jada, Jada finna eject us. Teen show. Titans Go. I'm about to eject my dang on so. <laughs> Teen Titans Go takes the comedy dynamic of Teen Titans and like flips it over a bunch of times. Like it's so good. They got to meet their own voice actors. That was funny. They got to fight the Justice <laughs> League. That was, the, was funny. But that's what all the shows are doing. Oh, yeah. you know, a lot of them. They did that with Chowder. Uh, no, no, they're doing it now. <laughs> no, they didn't. They didn't meet their voice actors. They just showed the voice actors. Yo, oh, yeah. oh, 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 that okay, episode okay. Of Chowder was hilarious. When it's right. Like, we, so don't we don't have any money. We don't have any money. For the record. animation, like Rada Rada, no, we can't go home. All right, y'all, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna break the fourth wall. We're getting recorded right now. We looking like that episode of Chowder where they had no budget. Yeah, I seen, I seen all, me and my dad watched all the Chowder. Yo, how much money do they need to get the animation back? Because they did just a car wash. I just thought about that. They raised like twenty bucks. Like, right, <laughs> yeah, that's enough. They just they just bought a sketchbook. That's all I heard. I think I think it was really like trying to drop all the other characters. <laughs> and then got... did anybody ever notice like their print on their clothing moved yeah. every time they move? I definitely know. Well, oh, no. here's the thing: yeah. it didn't move. Well, that's it the, didn't move. It stayed in one spot, but it right. looked like it almost like you looking through a window. Yeah. <laughs> it's a weird effect. You'd have to see it. <laughs> All right, but until next time, though, y'all, we see y'all, we see y'all next time. Just uh, let us know, though, in the comments. We're gonna be uploading on SoundCloud. You know, you're, that's where you can find us. You can find us on social media. Where where can they find us at, Lauren? Definitely find us at the Wolf U W G Instagram page. Hit us up on there. Woo-woo. Yes, sir. Mm-hmm. Yes, ma'am. Yes, sir. Everyone. <laughs> yes, people. <laughs> yes, human beings. And then also t- tune into the gaming with UWG. We'll also be giving, you know, Anastasia or some shout outs every once in a while. You yeah, know? yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course. And Share some of the quote. And we have a question of the week as well. And it's what do you consider an anime? Do you consider Teen Titans, Avatar, the Boondocks an anime? What do you not consider an anime? Come on. Let us know. Y'all have a good one. We're going to see you next week. See you. Ah, ah, I messed it up. See you, Space Cowboy. <laughs> Peace. <laughs>